This is Regenerate, Don't Degenerate on Thursday morning, and we're ready to exercise. What's the date? 20... What? 24th? 4th? I've been cleaning this morning already, so I'm pretty warmed up. First month of 2019 is almost gone. Shh. I hope we're all exercising. Today is a day for balance and stretching. So we're going to start with some stretching, some active stretching so that we can do our balance right. So let's just, I like the idea of twisting and turning. So yesterday, we were both our back. carrying, pushing, lugging heavy logs. And I thought about this exercise as we were doing it. I thought, well, I'm so super happy that we're exercising because this activity won't have as big of a bad bearing up on our body. And I feel a little bit of twinge up here. I don't know if it has anything you to do with that. You picked up a lot. I did pick up a lot. <laughs> Stretch to the side now, like this, up and over. I rolled mostly. Nah, I picked up some. <laughs> oh, that feels good. Well, so I was thinking about it, you know, that we got a good workout out there doing that, but it wasn't a full body workout like we did during the exercise time. No, and that's what I was saying. I actually thought, whoa, so glad we're exercising or else this would hurt my body. Yeah. Felt good. Got her done, didn't we? Yep. I have wood for a while. Yep. Got to do that a little bit more. We got to make it through January and February. And March. Yeah, March not as bad as January and February though. That's what I'm thinking. We're doing good though. Let's get our neck. Because I have to do stretch. slow. Going up and down. While you do that, I'm gonna run and change my shoes because of the balance. Yeah, you're gonna need some good shoe wear on today so you can balance. Let's go side to side with that neck now. Getting these muscle, muscles stretched out. So our warm up is active stretching today. And it's warm up so that we have control of our muscles and joints and everything that we need so that we can balance well, okay? We want to do a little bit of balance exercises, but that's important. Core engaged, right? We're standing up straight, that's so crucial. So let's lift our arms up and back, up and back. Take them up and back. In fact, let's let's also let's take our other arm and let's go like this. Oh, they'll get to see how bad I am. <laughs> That's okay. It's not about how bad we are. Oh my goodness! It's about how we continue to exercise. Look at the sunrise. Daily, if we can, keep the body moving. We're gonna have a sunrise today. Look. That's why it's cold. It's so pretty. Look at this. <laughs> a little bit of winter clouds going on, so you're getting that red and other colors yeah. in the sky. Sun's coming up. Well, this is a good up. exercise. I much yes. prefer this to just holding it. Yes. Well, you know, active stretching as opposed to static stretching, very... It, the same muscles, same joints get oh, exercised. Okay, that's, I'm done with that. Okay, shoulders <laughs> forward and back. Forward and back. Just keep our feet about shoulder width apart. We're standing up straight. Keeping our core engaged. Acknowledging our posture, watching it. Now what I want you to do, even when you're not exercising, pay attention to your posture. Are you standing up straight? Are you leaning forward? Especially when you're in a store as you're walking, Pull those shoulders back and pull your core in and walk. When you're not because thinking about it. Because it's such a good thing to do. When you're not thinking about it, think about it. It's crucial. Very crucial. We're gonna we're gonna do our legs now, okay? So I, I'm having you chair, wall, whatever you have to do to keep yourself balanced. Pick those legs up as high as you can. If it's only this high, it's only this high, okay? Whatever you can do, do. Keep that in mind. Any time that I demonstrate an exercise and encourage you to exercise, do it the way you can. Do it. That fell yesterday. It got crunched. Don't, don't 
hurt yourself. Don't push yourself past your abilities. Don't do more than feels good. You keep doing that, you're going to find exercise a pleasant experience because it's not going to hurt you. It's not going to tire you out. You're going to feel good while you're doing it. You're going to feel good after you're doing it. And you're going to feel better during the day. Okay, now, now we're going to do the, the one where we Dry. kick back, kick forward. Kick back. Uh, I'm going to do it opposite you. Okay. <laughs> Just trying to figure out which one you're doing. I always bend my knee when I kick back. Just yeah, that would get you. Ooh, this is. Yeah. Doing some stuff to the hamstrings. Well, <laughs> we haven't done this for a while, and what you and I did yesterday really worked on these legs. Got to tell you. A few more of these, then we're going to switch sides. Okay, switching sides here. Where are you starting? I'm going to kick forward. Back, forward, back. You did that on purpose. Forward, back. I can't do this. There we go. Forward, back. There we go. Couple more. Okay. Now we're gonna go out to the side now. Side. And if you haven't had hip surgery, you can go back that way. Side, back that way. Side. Just do a few of these because we haven't ever done this in here. Five. Okay, switching sides. Three, four, five. How are we doing with that? Okay, just some basic balancing that we're going to do. We're going to have our feet. Now, you can have them far apart if you have balance challenges. If you are better at your balance, bring them close together, even lining them up like this. You can have them out like that. And we're going to try to keep our weight evenly on both feet. And we're just kind of standing there. Pick your arms up and hold them out. Stand here just a little bit. We're working on our balance. Try to keep it steady and straight, right? Steady and straight. I'll lean a little bit to the side. Lean a little bit to the other side. I'm having a challenge with that. Lean forward a bit. Lean back a bit. Come up straight. Stand there a little bit more. Let's twist our arms around and we're pointing out like that. We're putting our foot that's forward and, and that's, that arm on that side is what we're putting out. You try going the other way, hard to do. So same arm, same foot forward, okay? Let them down, bring our feet back together. So now we're going to pick up one we're foot. We're not doing the opposite way. You're right, we need to do the opposite way. Duh! Come on, Jim. Think about it. Line your feet up. Now, you may be different from side to side, so you may have to put your feet differently to be comfortable in your balance, but don't push yourself to where you're falling over. Do this in a way that you're comfortable with it and that you have your balance. Try to distribute your weight evenly. Keep standing up straight. We're standing up straight. Let's put our hands out. Lean to the side, lean to the other side. I have trouble leaning to that side. I work on that balance. Come back to the center. I didn't do the other side. Lean forward, lean back, come up straight. Put your same hand of the foot that's out straight forward. Put it out there. Let's hold it there. There. Let's bring it back to center. Just let it down. Okay, let's come up. Now, what I want you to do is stand with where your feet are comfortable. The better your balance, the closer your feet. If you can have them right up close together, that's fine. 
We're, we're going to stand there. <clears throat> we're going to close our eyes so you really can't watch what I'm doing. <clears throat> but you don't need to. You know where your feet are. They're on the ground. You're comfortable. And you know where your head is. Yeah. <laughs> now stand up straight, right? You need to be standing up straight. And if you're finding, ooh, I'm in, this is hard, move your feet a little further apart, okay? Now I want you to just stand there with your eyes closed. And you're going to notice you wiggle around a bit, right? You're doing a little bit of wiggling. But stand there and try to keep yourself straight. Just keep letting your feet, your feet are sensing. Also allow yourself to deep breathe. Yeah, keep breathing. Don't stop. This is not a hold your breath kind of time, okay? Your feet, your feet, your, uh, your muscles, your joints, your equilibrium in, in your ears, everything is working right now to tell you where you are and to try to keep you standing up straight. So sense it, feel it, let it, let it work for you where it keeps you upright. Now we're going to lean to the right just a little. Just lean it over to the right. And this is still going to keep you standing up straight so you don't tip over. If you've got to move your feet a little further apart to feel comfortable with this, please do that. Bring it back up to center. Let's lean to the left now a little bit. Let's hold it over there. Lean to the left. We're trying to keep our posture upright while we're doing that. Let's bring it back up to the top. Let's lean back just a little bit. Lean ourselves back. Lean ourselves back. Bring it up to the center. Lean ourselves forward. Holding up there, holding up there, bring it back up to the top. Okay, spread your feet. You can open your eyes, spread your feet a little ways apart. Let's go up on our toes and let's try to stay there. This is going to work on your muscles a little bit, so you might not be able to do this very long. Work at this to where you can work up to it, but keep your balance while you're standing on your toes, just on your toes, keeping our balance there. <laughs> Jim. If you have to step. To Are we opening our eyes now? I, I did say open our oh, I'm eyes. I'm sorry, I, my brain. I was so relaxed. I was completely in a different world. <laughs> Seriously, I was. <laughs> now, a progression on even this one is to close your eyes, but I'm not suggesting you do that unless your balance is really, really good. But that can help you work it a little bit more. Okay, let's let it go down. We're always keeping our posture upright, except when I'm telling you to bend, right? It's a little harder. When you're front and back, you really can't. But when you're side to side, still try to keep yourself as upright as possible. So now we're going to take ourselves and we're going to lift up our, our right foot. Now, if you need to use it as a rudder to catch yourself, put it down and do that. But we're standing on one foot. We're going to balance on one foot. You can probably see a lot of progression opportunities, how you can add to this. Keep yourself upright and we'll do that over time but we're just working on getting started on our balance right now let's put that right foot down let's pick up the left foot now from foot to foot you may find some differences <laughs> plus yeah. you might be fatigued by now yeah so it's getting a little, my, my foot's going little like this. harder to do Woo! Little more of a challenge <laughs> okay let's put it down I want you to know, exercising every day, and we're doing a variety, right, but we're keeping your body moving. This is what you need to do. This is how you're going to regenerate, and let's do it in a way that we don't have pain. Let's do it in a way that we enjoy it, that we have a great time with. I, with having Rinda here, this is my accountability partner. I encourage you, even if it's somebody distant from me that you can't look eye to eye with every day, Get them as your accountability partner. Do this together. Communicate about it, how you're feeling about it, and, and make certain that you And you're give both us doing feedback. It. Yeah, love your feedback. I am getting feedback. We have people who keep commenting about how it's helping, what it's doing for them. This is a great thing to be exercising frequently. Stick with it. Look forward to having you here tomorrow. Until then, take care. This is Rinda and Jim. Regenerate, don't degenerate. Keep healthy.